on how to live your life, how to live your life. Don't you know that life is full of surprises? You better realize. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new then welcome to my channel. I'm Cami, and today's video is going to be basically a video about how I keep my home smelling nice or try to have it smell nice and like tips and all that kind of stuff. So if you guys are new and this is your kind of content that you enjoy, like I'm a young mom, I make lifestyle content, vlogs, cooking and cleaning. Um, the cleaning one is new. Um, so if you guys like that, I hope that you will consider subscribing and joining my YouTube family. So I have a little list here of stuff that I do or want to talk about. And if I don't have it in front of me, I will insert a clip of me showing you the product. Or if I don't have the product, a picture of the product or um, just how we use it or something like that. So the first thing I am... Also, I just want to say this... Uh, are just my tips this doesn't obviously have to work for everyone you might not like some of the products or you just might have opinions on them or whatever um but these are just my tips on how i help you know keep my my house smelling pretty good so yeah the first one that i'm going to talk about is the airwick plugins um i've talked about this i think in a vlog or in a q a or something um that my favorite scent right now is because it is fall time is like the pumpkin spice <laughs> so of course i have an airwick and pumpkin spice um but these are the ones we use they are the pumpkin spice um this is the one i use now but they're just like the airwick plugins and we have them in a few rooms i have one in our bedroom i have one in what's called the cat's room for now until you know we get pregnant again um Right now it's just kind of the guest room and the cat's room um, with the litter box in there. So definitely need one of those in there. So there's one in there. We also have one in my son's room and then in like the dining room slash kitchen area. We also have one. Um, so yeah, they are just little things you plug into here and they just plug into an outlet like normal. There's also Glade makes them, but I just, this, these are the ones that we have. And they make a bunch of scents. Um, they also have like calming ones like lavender and stuff. But because it's fall time, I really like the scent of pumpkin. So mine have pumpkin spice in right now. But yeah, they're just made with um, essential oils. And they have this little thing at the, the top that you can move. Um, it says it lasts up to 45 days. And with that little top, you can move how much like smell or aroma you want out. Um, I'll show you guys a little clip in a bit. Yeah, we have these. I guess you're back. Are you gonna tell me where you went? All the messages I sent with no reply. It's like that. The next little thing that we use is a wax melt. We've had quite a few different ones, um, but they are usually made of glass, and if you break them, then they are gone. But again, I will insert a clip, but it's basically just like this little they come in cute designs we have a, a cute one that we like and we keep it in our kitchen and there's a bunch of different little wax things which i will also show you guys that you just kind of set on top and there's a light bulb and it melts the wax and it gives off a little bit of an aroma and it's we also use it for like a night light and stuff but those also come in a bunch of very yummy smelling scents and of course right now i'm using the pumpkin ones so that's another tip for you that I have um you're just gonna walk into my room I hate how you assume I'll take the pleasure and the pain the sorrows in your brain cause I know you're on the run I'll take the pleasure and the pain your secrets to my the next one is essential oils if you're not an essential oil person then I'm sorry but I love essential oils and we use them for a lot of things as you will can tell from like what's going to come <laughs> but yeah my tip is essential oils we have two diffusers in our home one in our bedroom and then one also in our kitchen um the one in our bedroom has like a sound machine attached to it but these are some of like my favorite ones i actually have a lot of favorite ones um we either get them from earthbound we have a shop here 
not here, but it's like 30 minute drive, called Earthbound that sells essential oils. I cannot talk. Every time I get in front of the camera, my mouth just doesn't work. Um, but yeah, they sell essential oils um, and they have different, a lot of different scents and like they also do like holiday stuff. You can also of course order them on Amazon and probably Walmart has them too. Um, these two are from Amazon. So you guys can't speak Amazon. Um, this one is lemongrass, which I love. It smells so good. And this one is lavender, which I will use in my diffuser for like bedtime or I will put it on my sun for like sleeping because that's supposed to help. Um, so yeah, lavender smells really nice. And then lemongrass is also one of my favorites. You can just put them in the diffuser with some water and it gives off a really nice smell. And a lot of them Essential oils are supposed to help like calm you and relax you and they do a bunch of different stuff if you want to google that on your own time So yeah, we have a diffuser that we use for essential oils. I also have a tip for you guys for like your bathroom So your toilet paper roll you can put I'll use the lemongrass one because um, this is for my bathroom so Just like in here. You just do a couple of drops. I'll do a couple on this side and a couple on this side and every time you unroll your toilet paper you will get off a little bit of a scent which is you know something nice to smell when you're in the bathroom so that's a tip for you guys that I have if you have not tried that lemongrass smells so good <laughs> um, so also I have another tip for it can be used a couple of different ways um, the ways that I have been using them is in trash bags or in um, a closet and the only time I use it for trash bags is like if we have a really sinky trash like our, our main like kitchen trash um, even though we do use scented garbage trash bags which is another tip I have for you guys Glade and all of that makes um, scented trash bags but if you guys don't have a scented trash bag or if like in your bathroom you can put um, essential oil on like a little this is just like the face cleaner or whatever nail polish cleaner um, I'll show you the this is what it is it just these little con pad thingies or you can use like an actual cotton round um, and just put essential oil on it and then you could put it underneath your trash bag so that helps you know take away some of the stinky stinks um, and then I also use this in my son's closet that has his like diaper I think it's a diaper genie diaper genie in there and then also in where we keep our shoes um, and it does help and it does give off a nice scent so if you guys want to try that that would be a really good tip so again I said the scented trash bags we do use a scented trash bag for our like kitchen throwaway icky trash um, also another thing that I've been doing recently is putting the essential oil and like after I wash the dishes and the sink is all clean, I will do a couple like little dabs of it onto like the little sink thingy, sink, sink stopper. We don't have a garbage disposal for so the little stoppy part. Um, I put a couple down there just to like freshen up the sink so it smells nice. And usually every time I walk past, I can smell it and it makes me happy. Cause you are the only one. I already talked about the toilet paper roll and then of course obvious things are just keeping your house clean um, you can obviously use things specifically for your carpet like carpet cleaner the little stuff like sprinkles out and yeah so just keep your house clean there's always house sprays this is one that we use of course it's in pumpkin scent this is by Glade um, limited edition toasty pumpkin spice and we just do this if somebody's coming over um, like really quickly or I honestly do it if I just am in the mood for some pumpkin spice smells, I will spray this and I really, really enjoy it. I think this can was like 97 cents or something at Walmart, so very, very inexpensive. Um, and then of course, candles. I love candles. I really just love smells and things that just make me happy. I enjoy like essential oils and all that. That's just the scent always makes me very happy and having a clean home or just having a really good smelling home is just something that makes me proud and makes me just happy because good smells are nice. <laughs> So 
So yeah, those are my tips for keeping your house smelling nice. If you guys have any tips for me, leave them down below if you would like to share with me or anyone else. I hope this helped you and I hope you got some ideas or something, you know, that will help you or that you want to try out. And thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.